I'm Brian Ross, and this is the NWI.com Daily News Update for January 10th. The House Labor Committee voted 8-5 to five today to send right-to-work legislation to the full House. Under objections from House Democrats, the committee chairman, Republican State Rep. Douglas Gutwein, ordered the bill up for vote. The committee's eight Republicans voted for the bill, while the five Democrats voted no. Most Republicans believe the labor policy will bring new jobs to Indiana. Well, Democrats say it is intended to weaken labor unions. An Indiana State Senate committee approved a bill that makes attending an organized animal fight a Class D felony, publishable by up to three years in prison and a fine of up to $10,000. Current Indiana law limits felonies for animal fighting to organizers, promoters, or people who bring animals to fight. The committee voted 5-4 to four to forward the legislation to the full Senate. Estimates from the American Iron and Steel Institute say local steel production rose 3,000 tons over the last week. Local steel mills produced 511,000 total tons for the week that ended Saturday. Nationally, an estimated 1.9 million tons of steel has been produced in 2012, compared to 1.8 million tons at the same time in 2011. William Conover, a Valparaiso native who served on the Indiana Court of Appeals, died Monday at the age of 86. Conover graduated from Valparaiso University in 1949 and Valparaiso University School of Law in 1951. He served as judge of Valparaiso City Court and later as Porter County Prosecutor from 1963 to 1971. Governor Robert Orr approved, appointed him to the Court of Appeals in 1981. He retired in 1993. For updates on these stories and more, log on to nwi.com or check out the Times iPhone, Android, and our new iPad apps.